I nagged my parents for a torch. I'd love a torch. Oh, go on. One of those ones with the black rub around them. Oh, go on. Go on. It was no good. I wasn't getting anywhere. Then came my birthday. On the table was a big box. In the box, a torch. My dad took it out the box. You see that torch, he says. Hmm? <laughs> it's waterproof. That is a waterproof torch. So that night, I got into the bath and went underwater swimming with it. Breathe in, <gasps> under the water, switch on, <laughs> search for shipwrecks and treasure, up, breathe, <gasps> and under again, exploring the ocean floor, then the torch went out. <laughs> I shook it and banged it, but it wouldn't go. I couldn't get it to go again. My birthday torch, so I got out the bath, dried myself off, put on my pyjamas, and went into the kitchen. The, um, the torch... Uh, won't work, uh, it's broken. And my dad says, what do you mean, it's broken? It couldn't have just broken. How did it break? I don't know. <laughs> it just went off. I don't believe it. You ask him a simple question and you never get a simple answer. You must have been doing something with it. No. No, it just went off. Just try telling the truth, will you? How did it break? I was underwater swimming with it. Are you mad? <laughs> when I said this torch is waterproof, I meant it keeps the rain off. I didn't mean you could go bloody deep sea diving with it. <laughs> ruined, completely ruined. For weeks and weeks, he nags a stupid that he wants one of these waterproof torches, and the first thing he does is wreck it. How long did it last, Connie? Hmm? Two minutes? Three minutes? These things cost money, you know, Mazuma, money. <laughs> At the weekend, he says, we're going into Harrow to take the torch back. Oh, we walk into the shop. My dad goes up to the man at the counter and he says, you see this torch? Hmm? I bought it from you a couple of weeks ago. It's broken. So the man picks it up. Well, it couldn't have just broken, says the man. How did it break? And my dad says, I don't know. It just went off. <laughs> well, surely you must have been doing something with it. No, no, no. No, no, says my dad. No, no, it just went off. Oh, come on, says the man. These torches don't just break down. You must have been doing something with it. So I said... Yeah, well, actually, um, I was in the bath and I got a kick on the ankle from my dad. <laughs> like that. Oh, I was in the, uh, oh, yeah, the kitchen. Yeah, that's right. And it went off. So the man said he would take it out the back to show Len. <laughs> he came back in a few minutes and said that Len couldn't get it to work either. You'll have to have a new one, he says. I should think so, too. <laughs> says my dad. Thank you. Outside the shop, my dad says to me, what's the matter with you? Huh? You were going to tell him all about your underwater swimming fandango, weren't you? Are you crazy? 